Sup guys, Hey King here, bringing you another live reaction to this month's Attack on Titan. Holy crap, we had to wait a month. No, no, we had to wait two months before we got the next chapter. Jesus, that that was a long way. I mean, hot damn. But, you know, Is Isayama deserved it. He deserved that one month break. But uh, I think a lot of us were like, oh, we're going to get two chapters for the besides the price. So I no, no, it's only one chapter. We're only getting one chapter. So, yeah, unfortunately. But that's good. It's good for him because, honestly, he does deserve the break. Uh, so, you know, that one month for him just resting up, that's... Yeah, I, I get that. And he deserves it. As far as I'm concerned, considering he's been dishing this out for, like, what, 10 years, 11 years straight now for us? Like, it's crazy. Anyway... Chapter 129, uh, I'm about to sneeze here, am I going to sneeze here? <coughs> there we go, bless me. And the chapter is called Nostalgia, and God bless leaks, because leaks always come out like a few days just before the official translation. This is technically a, a fan translation, so you know, it might be a bit off. But, but let, let's see how accurate uh, they are, let's see what's going on, where we left off. Where did we live off last time? Um... We had the uh, we had the uh, allies trying to steal the uh, ship with the plane, right? And then they got caught by Daz and some other guy, and I think they killed them. And I think Armin got shot several times unexpectedly, and I think Connie was with him. And uh, Annie and Reyna were fighting, and Flock got his ass kicked by Ki Kiyomi and that. So yeah, a lot of crazy shits happening. So let, let, let's get to it. Let's get to it. Let's just jump right into this. Liberal linguist. Okay, that's uh, that's, that, that's not part of that. So page one, chapter 129, Nostalgia. Sorry if I'm shouting out loud. This voice is behind there. It's annoying and irritating. So we got Armin reaching down to the... Reaching down, I think. This is the dock, obviously. The port, the ship port. And someone's falling into the water. Uh, I think that's whoever got shot. I don't, I don't think... Is that is that meant to be Connie? I don't think that's Connie. I think that's whoever got shot. Yeah, Connie just saved Armin's life, I believe. I think that's Daz that's dead. And Connie's looking up and he sees Connie, he, Armin's looking up and he sees Connie on top of uh, the guy who I think he shot. Yeah, Connie's horrified. There's the guy with bullets in his, three bullets in his face. Head, two in his head, one in his face. Yeah, so like uh, two here, one here. And Armin's just sort of bleeding out and crying. And we're cutting to, uh, I believe, page two and three, which is a nice big panel shot where we, on one side, we got Raynor smashing through the buildings. Uh, uh, trying to attack the Jaegerists, Ye Ye and then you got the other spread, and there's there's, there's uh, uh, Annie in a female Titan form behind uh, behind Armin and Connie smashing through that area there. So yeah, a lot, a lot of hectic action going on. That's a pretty cool. That's a pretty cool spread there. Like, uh, huh? I, I might I might make that my uh, thumbnail <laughs> for this because uh, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah. There we go, and then we got Jean and Hanji going down the uh, basement. I think they were trying to blow something up, weren't they? Uh, there's Hanji with uh, McGuff, Jean, uh, mcgoff has got his little pistol, Jean with his rifle, and there's Hanji with another rifle. Uh, yeah, yeah, she's got a rifle, so I, I thought she was like pulling a box or something, no, but no, she. they're in a basement and they're taking cover and looking down, and Hanji's like, what did you say? Uh, they're talking to Kiyomi's people, so there's Kiyomi in the next panel, and there's like three of her aides. Uh, it usually takes a day for the maintenance uh, before we can fly the plane. If it's in good condition, half a day will do. Oh, wow, uh, well. So they need to maintenance the plane before they can they can fly it. That's if it's in good condition. So if it's not in good condition, then uh, that's a day gone. Damn, uh, and McGough is speaking like half a day. You expect us to hold off the enemy for that long. The enemy will keep sending reinforcements. It's impossible to hold off for that long with Titan powers, which can only last a couple hours. It's Hanji's like it's too it's too late. Uh, Mongols just looks at her. The rumbling is faster than horses, and it can go through obstacles. Yeah, roughly 600 kilometers from the coast will be damaged, and it will take four days to destroy the entire continent. Oh my God! Four days to destroy the entire continent, like. Isn't isn't this technically like a parallel world of of us? Like, do you know what I mean? So, I mean, they're they're in, they're in technically uh, uh, in Madagascar right now, and these guys are going to what? Um, to the mainland. Like, so where where would that? It, 
So is that how small the world is that it would literally take four days just to eradicate all of that? Like, uh, that's just crazy. Like, I mean, how fast how fast are these titans walking? Like, they they have to walk through 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 the sea and then, and emerge and then go through the buildings and like and the walls. Like, it's crazy. Uh, yeah, when Hanji says there's like Kiyomi and, and, and the AIDS, there's like, there's like two more AIDS there. So now, now it's five AIDS. <laughs> and they're shocked, like, and McGough is shocked, Gene's shocked, and Hanji's continuing to talk. Even if we stopped Erin as fast as possible, Liberio is already doomed. Yeah, we're getting a fl uh, Gene's having a flashback to those people that he was uh, having a time of his life with. That's sad, there's a little boy and his grandpa, there's Connie in the background. There's Sasha, I believe, at the time, and there's there's Aaron there, all the way in the back. You can hardly make out his face, and there's Gene, obviously, in the front with the old man drinking a thing, and he's got the little hat. Oh, that's sad, no way. And McGough's just like, even if we fly, we won't be able to locate Aaron. It will take more time. Holding off here for half a day is already impossible. And then Kiyomi's talking, I have an idea. So, Kiyomi's got an idea. What's your idea? All right, come on, give it to us. Oh, we're getting a we're getting a nice little uh, panel map shot here. Um, I keep forgetting where Madagascar's. Uh, I mean, obviously this is not Madagascar, but when you when you reverse the maps, that's that's where Par Paradis Island is located, right? So that's what I mean by parallel world and that. But uh, so what what what? I'm so confused there. Like, so what what's she saying? A city south from here is Odihan, in which in which Azamobito family has a facility. We can get the plane ready there. So, so okay. So she's gonna. I'm assuming they're gonna say get the ship, and pilot the ship to the facility so they can get the uh, plane ready. How long is it gonna take to pilot the ship to, to drive the? Pl Do you know what I mean like we can leave now on a ship with the plane docked and have the plane to and and have the plane to fly from there, fly from fly from there. Okay. And then, okay, Marlene and uh, Hanjo giving that look. Marlene's coast in terms of distance wouldn't it be destroyed by the rumbling soon? Odiha is ahead of the rumbling, but staying there for half a day is a gamble. Gamble. My gosh, just like, anyway, flying from here is impossible. Yeah, they can't fly from here. Like, like they said, you need half a day just to prep the plane, and that's if it's in good shape. If it's not in good shape, you're going to need a whole day just to prep it, so... And, and that's, that's, that's holding up enemy forces coming at you left, right, and front, like, so... Okay, it looks like they're moving now, so... Yeah, if I remember correctly, uh, 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 Kiyomi's, Kiyomi's aides are, are are the mechanics, so that's who these guys, I think, are. So yeah, uh, Hanji's like moving now, she's moving the boxes out of the way, uh, moving with her, Jean. So, uh, <laughs> it, it, who's talking first? Is there a coil on the ship? Yes, sir. Uh, but it takes around 30 minutes to leave, uh, um, and McGough's like, 15 minutes. If you guys die, know that not only Hizura, but the whole world will end. Um, and Hanji's like, I'll, uh, um, okay, I'm, I'm trying to figure out who to, who to read first, Gene. I'll call Captain Levi and, and, and others. Uh, Mik uh, Hanji, I'll tell Mik Mikasa. Okay, so everyone's moving. Panel shot of, um, just, just, oh, did Annie just, Annie just kicked through a building and kicked one of those guys away. And there's Raina in the background, just like, I think someone just shot a thunder spear at, at his feet, but it went between his feet, so on the ground, thank, thank God. Uh, oh, someone's coming for uh, Annie's neck. Uh, take this, they're about to shoot a thunder spear, but I think someone's sword just went through there. Annie's trying to cover it up. It's Mikasa to the rescue. Mikasa just saved Annie's life. Change of plans. We'll escape with the ship and fly from the continent. Help us reach to the to the ship. So uh, Annie's just landed on... Mikasa has just landed on Annie and is telling her this. So yeah. Help us reach the ship. Uh, there's there's rain in the background. Maintenance on the con on the continent. It's unsafe here for sure, but would we be able to able to beat the Founding Titan with that? Did oh oh Annie just did did Annie just do that? I think she just sliced through someone in half with just her hands like flat. This dude's just he's just tall like holy shit. Will I be able to go to my dad in Librio? Librio's doomed though. Didn't they say that? Uh, my gosh, just like now. Okay, he's he's providing cover like, and there's there's Rayo punching through the building, and there's uh, Kiyomi and our, and our mechanics running for their lives out of this hall. Oh, and there's Flock, there's Flock finally showing his ugly self. It's the Azamobito killer. Oh, okay, he's with like three of his men, and they're taking aim with rifles. And okay, who's this? I think two people just flew in here. One of them just kicked the dude at the far end in the corner. 
uh, who's just who's just like who already got held up, and the other two who are just about to aim and fire just got the heads or necks sliced. Uh, that's a weird. That's a, that's a weird shot of a uh, flock there. Like he looks all young in the upper panel, and then here he looks like an old man. Like, like <laughs> it's weird. It's weird how they're doing that. It's it's is that Hanji? Did, did Hanji do all of that? I'm so confused. Or is that Mikasa? I'm thinking. I'm thinking Mikasa is the one that kicked the dude, and Hanji's the one that just yeah. Hanji's the one that just came in and sliced those other two. And now, and now, Flock is uh, aiming at, uh, aiming two pistols at her. Oi, you traitors! Why is Azuma Bito out there? Why is she out there risking her life? No, wait. Uh, Flock's like looking, and there, there, there's one dude coming in, one of the elites, and he's firing his pistol, shooting at the mechanics, and they're covering now with fear. Raider, Megos, like screaming, Raider, like. <laughs> no, there's Raider coming in and protecting the Azuma Bitos, reaching out his hand, covering them. Oh, but this this gives the elite uh, this gives the Jaegers an opening shot to fire the thunder spears. Three of them just shot thunder spears right like into here into his into his like shoulder. Ugh. There's McGough shooting. He he just killed one of them. Like good run. You know he's like telling them to run. Go for Azumabito. Take care of the female titan later. I think that's Flock screaming out orders. You got more Jaegers jumping from the rooftop towards the Azumabitos, and there's Annie there like. To the other side. Oh, they're firing thunder spears at them. Oh shit! Oh shit! And Annie just came in like she just came in like that, and the thunder spears like like they, the the are here. And there's Annie's hand. And she just came in like that, and the thunder spears just went into her arm. Oh, is that gonna blow? That's gonna blow her arm off. Yeah, that's gonna blow. Yeah, it blew her arm off. Like as you oh, did it. Yeah, it blew her arm off. Yeah, it exploded. But the but Kiyomi and the Azumitos are fine. I'm gonna stop it here Back again. Holy crap! This chapter's like getting way intense, man. Like. So Addy just Addy just saved Addy just saved yeah, Kiyomi and the Azuma Bitos and McGough basically. And she's looking to see if they're fine. McGough's pulling these guys out, it's like get up! The ship is right there, like run for it. And there's and there's Annie and her arm is gone, that arm she just sacrificed. And there's the Jaegerist, uh, you're getting in the way. Oh, oh they're gonna are they they're going for oh they're going for Annie. They're going for Annie, they're gonna kill her. She's about to die, and Raina just came in covering her, like, oh my god, he's shielding her. He just came in and took <laughs> Took the uh, took the spears into his face. One of them just went for his uh, went through the chin here. Another one in the ear. Another one like between like near his eye here. Uh, and two more. One here and one here. Like oh god, oh god. It just exploded. Yeah. The and the Azuma Beetles they're behind them and they're running for their ship now. Rainer's there. He's damaged, but he's still fine. He's still fine. It didn't get inside. It didn't hit his eyes. He's still fine. I think. And Annie's just like looking at it, and there's Flock. Are they thinking of escaping with the ship, with the plane? This is not good. Are they going to fly away from the continent? And now he's turning to all these men. Bring all the thunder spears. They're going right to Eren to kill him. Do whatever you can to destroy the ship. If Eren dies, Paradise will sink into a sea of blood. Your parents, siblings, and children will all die. Dedicate your heart. So oh, this guy is just like. This guy. Just feels like a freaking cult leader at this point, man. Like, what an asshole. Like, I get where he's coming from, but, like, the freaking god complex and ego that this dude has. Like, Flock needs to die. Like, I've been I've been waiting for him to die for, like, two, three chapters now. Like, he needs to freaking die. Like, I'm sick and tired of him. I'm seriously sick and tired of him. So, now we're going into the next page. And then a little panel, you got uh, Peckhams in a, in a cart titan form. And on top of her are... Uh, yeah, I forgot Yalina. She got her hand broken, didn't she? There's Yalina with uh, Okobayu, and next to him is uh, Gabby and Levi and Falcom. And Falcom's like, ah, oh, geez. They started to go for the ship. Ah, oh, geez. It sounds like Moya. Ah, oh, geez. <laughs> Who's saying they just started to go? Is that Yalina or is that Okobayu saying they started to go for the ship? Anyway, these guys are. Look at Levi there, like in the next panel. Like, he's tied. He, he's tied up in, uh, on the card tie. Like, there's, there's like a big rope there, like, going around the card tie, and Levi's like nestled in between that. <laughs> wow, like, that's how. That's how I'm, I'm starting to wonder, man. Uh, since Levi can't technically fight anymore, what if he ends up being the one to pilot the plane, for example, and he decides to do like a cover card so he's start right into like, like, whatever, like, to save someone or to get someone there? Because, like,. He can't do anything now. Do you know what I mean? Like, think about it. Like, the, the only thing he's he, he, the only thing he can do really is is just sit somewhere maybe and pilot something, control something because he can't he can't swing around and fight anymore. So he's out of the fight. So yeah, uh, the, the guys are heading there. They can see Annie and Raina 
blocking the Thunder Spear attacks. Oh god. Rainer just lost a hand. Those two won't last. Uh, yeah, no, both of them just lost hands. Like, the. They're blocking that with that with the free hands now, Jesus! And there's this Falcon watching it. I must fight. What? I must fight with my Jewel Titan. And who's this with the no? And uh, Peckham's talking. No. Is is Falcon gonna transform now and help them out? That's ridiculous. Doesn't he need to train to control? It's not easy transforming for the first time. No, that's that's her talking in a Titan form. But if they keep this up, leave it to me. I'll fight after I bring you to the ship. No, no. I think they're about to. I think Reyna and Annie are about to die. Yeah, Reyna just got hit. Got hit in in the in in. I think he's doing this, but he's just got hit in the crotch. I think or, or in the abs, and Annie just lost another hand, like another arm. So now she's armless. Like she's screwed. She's screwed right now. And and Falco's like, if 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 it was Mr. Galliard instead of me, he wouldn't be staying here like this. Oh, he just chopped off Peckham's and he's running for it. He wouldn't be sitting here debating about what to do. Falcon. We're going to the ship, and Peckham's like, no, we're going to the ship first. No, she's not going to stop him, and Falcom's running for it. Next panel, we got the mechanics getting on the ship. And Raina and Annie are just taking a beating in the background there. Get on, hurry up and prepare to depart. And there's McGough, and he sees Connie and Armin come in. Like, Connie's carrying Armin, like, like he's still smoking. He was shot in the chest and his stomach, also in the jaw. It, it, uh, it will heal quickly, and you... I know something. It will heal. I think McGuff is saying it will heal quickly. And you, I'll protect. And Connie's like, I'll protect the ship. And there's Peckham's coming up from the dock. Okay, they, they, she jumped in the water and, and swam there with them. Okay, General McGuff, Falcom is, and McGuff's like, what? So now we're cutting to yeah, we're cutting, we're cutting to we're cutting to Hanji and Mikasa on top of the rooftop, and uh, in the background they're looking at Mikasa's looking at uh, Annie and. Uh, Reyna just getting screwed. We have to help Reyna and Annie. And Andre's like, but reinforcements are coming from the station. We have to stop it. We won't be able to leave. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Andre's looking to the other side and she can see a train coming to the station there. Like, oh god, oh god. Oh, what just happened there? The train just exploded. It, it was on a, it's, it's like, it's like on a mountain, it's like on a hill track, like just behind them coming and it just exploded like from the, from the, from the front. No, from between the front and the next car, like, the car in the middle between them just exploded, like, what? Yeah, <laughs> that, that, that's my same reaction, that's what I just said, what? Like, I'm just like, what? Me, what? And then the Jaeger is Falcon, uh, uh, sorry, Flock, what? That's, our reinforcements have been hit, but by whom? Yeah, the, the train's off rails now, it's just crashed. Oh my god, and there's Falcon, and he just used the nail to cut himself. And, and Jean's on top of a dust on a bin or whatever, looking at him like, What are you doing, Falcon? Get on the ship right right now. In the background, you got Annie. Oh, my God, Annie. Annie's head just blew off. So there, there's Raina still doing this. And next to him is Annie, armless, and her head just went flying. Um, oh, my God, Raina. Oh, my God, Raina, Annie. Wow, Jean's looking. And Raina has no arms. Amy has no, Annie has no arms and head. She's got a bit of a, like, 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 like that one there. Just gone, and Jesus, it's, it's, and, and Rain is like, I think the only thing uh, left is, is like the top of his head there. Like, the jaw part is gone. Oh, they're gonna kill them. They're going for it. It's now or never. End them. And Rain is like, I can't move. And Annie's like, I can't see. Oh, oh, they're gonna die. Oh, they're gonna die. They're going for it. Oh, they're going for it. Uh, oh, who just... Someone just... Did someone just jump in the way? Yeah, Connie. Connie just... Oh, my God. Connie just jumped. He just jumped past Annie towards Reyna and past towards the Jaegerists. And he's and he's got his swords out and he just slashed one dude through the head, like, f like through here. Like, that's gone. Oh, my God. Connie's killing them. Connie, like... And he's screaming like, ah, and, and they're trying to shoot, oh my god, they're trying to shoot him, die, Connie's like, die, and they're like, you traitor, you got three guys like, shooting at him, like, with their pistols, and Connie's just like, <laughs> trying to deflect them and fly at the same time, and from behind, those guys get their asses kicked, I, admit, I don't think, Mik is Mikasa killing these guys? I think she's just knocking them out, but Hanji's going for their kill. Maybe it's too fast to see, I I'm not too sure, no, I think, I think, I think Mikasa just came in. And slice through one of them, and and Hanji just killed the other one, and the one dude that's still alive, he turns. 
he turns to see and he get he gets shot by Gene like from behind like on, on top of the roof so he's done and Gene's like if we hesitate comrades will die oh what a call back to the uprising arc man remember 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 when Gene hesitated and Armin had to take the shot it's all coming it's all coming full circle man it's all coming full circle here like like Cody, Gene, everyone's just jumping in like no our allies are gonna die we don't do anything and there's Peckham's on the ground there like there's Peckham's and she just jumped up and just gobbled up she just gobbled up two people like in, in one hit like oh my god uh, and now she's on the rooftop and there's Flock on another rooftop Flock I know and oh my god they're all running and now the, the, the Jaegerists have all assembled and use the spears on the cart and use the guns to take out the traders we do it at the same time all at once protected our island our country and they're all going for Peckham's now. Oh, they're shooting. They're shooting the Thunder Spears. And Peckham's is trying to avoid it all. There's Connie and Mikasa dodging it. Uh, oh, my God. And there's the Hunchy ducking from gunfire. Jean just took cover behind a chimney. Uh, is that... Ooh, that's Mikasa cutting some dude's eyes out. And there's Falcon running. Running, trying to help. And, like... He raises his hand like like that, like looking at it. I think that's the hand he just cut. And there's a big, massive flash of light. I think he's about to transform. Yeah. And 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 Gabby and McGuff are seeing this from the boat. Like Gabby's like, no way. Did Falcon just? And McGuff's like, I'll leave you to it, Gabby. Yes, sir. Leave you to what? Oh, does Gabby's got a rifle? Like she's shooting as well. Like she's a warrior. Of course she would help out in the fight. And and now we're cutting to Okabayu and the mechanics. They're in the ship now and they're, and they're doing the coil, like getting the coil moving. Oh, and now we got our first look at, at Falcom's uh, Jaw Titan. And it's weird. Wow, it's weird looking. Uh, remember when he transformed into a normal Titan and he, look, he looked like a freaking chicken? This one's a bit weird. Um, so he's. Yeah, I don't know how to describe it. Galliard like had the whole full jaw set, right? This one, this one's like two mouths. Like it's like I kind of think it makes me think of a shark. Really, you've got the normal mouth, and then under that you've got like the the jaw armor here, and then up there you've got the rest of the jaw armor covering his head and face and that. And his nose looks like a looks like a beak. Like it's like very sharp, like a beak. And his hands, his hands look like. <laughs> They, they look like bird hands, they look like chicken or falcon hands, like they look like talons, basically. And there he is, like, crushing them, oh god. And oh, he just ripped a bunch of guys. And who's that, who's that, that's, that's Peckham's watching, Falcom. And Gene's like, now, they are collapsing. And Connie is going in, it's now or never. And there's Hunchy stabbing another, and there's Mikasa, they're all going in. They're using this distraction that Falcom has just provided for them to go in and kill the remaining guys. And there's Flock, there's Flock going towards Peckham's, and Peckham's just sort of scaling the wall, mouths open wide, while behind her is Falcon scaling on top of the roof with his beak like. Okay, now it looks like a jaw, now, now it looks like a jaw, it's like that, now it's like, 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 like that from the side, so, it's like that, from the front, and from the side, it's like that, so that's crazy, man. <laughs> and Flock's just like, oh shit, like, <laughs> did Peckham just jump, I don't know what's going on, I think, I think, did, What's going on here? I'm so confused. Oh, he's just swearing. He's like, he's like, fudge. He's saying fudge. We, we both know he's not saying fudge, but that's what he's saying. Uh, I'm so confused here. Like, I think, I think the time just ran out. Sorry, like, uh, about that. So yeah, back again. Um, I think the cart titan just jumped off the side of the wall, mouth open, trying to get flock, and he just dodged out of the way and. Uh, uh, Peckham's just smashed into another building on the opposite side and he just flew up uh, above Hunji and she's like screaming no and Flock's going for the ship oh my god he's going for the ship one of them made it out he's going past Annie and Reyna and he's going for the ship one shot will do it just one shot at the bottom of the ship oh if he shoots that the ship will sink explosion reaction shots of Connie, Jean, Hunji, Mikasa and Peckham's I am the one who is going to save LD and just before he could shoot it he gets shot in the I think he just got shot in the shoulder and he shot missed he fight he, the shot caused him to fire like that and it, and, and, it, and it misdirected and the missile the spear hit the water and there's Gabby she just shot this Gabby just shot flock okay she shot him in the arm though so 
There's there, there, there she is, bolt actioning that rifle, and Flock just fell in the, in, into the ocean. Gabby, nice Hodgie. Gabby, good job. Yeah, well done. Well done, Gabby. She just saved, <laughs> she just saved the ship and and the plane's life and everyone on board. Like, and there's the Jaegerist. Flock, no. Flog, uh, and that dude just got, oh, he just got his head sliced like that by Mikasa. What's going on? I think the rest of them have given up. And there's Okubayu with Gabby on top of the ship. We're leaving. Get in. Oh, I, I, I think the rest of them are running away. The rest of the Jaegers are running away now that Flock is dead. And there's Connie, uh, Hanji, and Mikasa with their blades drawn on the roof. And there's Jean in, in, on, on the corner there shooting <laughs> ahead of them. And Jean's like turning, let's go, before those guys come back. Oh shit, Falcom's going on a rampage. He's going on a rampage. Oh, we knew this. See, this is what I mean. He hasn't had training, so he hasn't learned to control his power yet. And he just burst out from one of the buildings and he's going for it. And Jean turns like, what? He's attacked them. Oh, he's attacking them. And Peck is like, Falcom, there are no enemies. Get out. Get out. Uh, Peckham, oh, Peckham's engaging Falcom. Shit. Oh, Peckham just, oh no, Falcom, Falcom just, just, just attacked uh, the Cop Titan, and he's got his jaws around her neck, oh god, what, and Gabby sees it, what, Falcom, oh, he's killing Peckham, man, Gov's running for him, Peckham, take down Falcon, Falco, Falco, someone's taking out a blade, what's going on here, oh, oh, uh, Peckham, I think Peckham just got her legs around him, and, and she's pulling him close, He's got fur on him as well, like, uh, Falcom's, the Titan bomb's got fur. Someone just got a blade out. Someone, no, no, someone's pushing one of those, uh, uh, blades into the flesh. It's McGough, he's taking Falco out. It's okay now, Falco, you did well. He's taking Falco out, okay. Okay, McGough just saved Falco and Peckham's life, okay, uh. And everyone, uh, the survivors are just heading for the ship now, and there's Okobayu on the stairs. Get on, quick! Oh man, these guys, they, these guys are supposed to are supposed to stop the rumbling, like look at them, they're defeated, like, there's Mikasa carrying Annie and she's like defeated as hell, there's McGough carrying Falco, uh, there's Connie and Raina supporting, uh, no, uh, Jean supporting Raina and there's, there's Hanji supporting Perkums, it's crazy, this is actually, this is, oh this might, you know what, this might be my thumbnail, this is such a good shot actually, I like this. That's a good shot. Uh, are you uh, okay? I've, I've, I don't, uh, who's saying what to who for now? Uh, is that is Okubayu like for now? And McGough, McGough, he's handing Falco to Okubayu. Leave now. And he's like, what? What about you? I'll take care of it here. Oh man, is is McGough gonna sacrifice himself now? Oh man. Pe Peckham's Raina, Jean, and Hanji are turning. They're like, what? They we're getting a shot of the plane. It's all covered up in that. They're leaving. The ship's going now with the plane. There's the body of that dude that uh, Connie shot, still on the dock. Where's this? Yeah, I'll respond later. Oh no. Oh no. I just, I just skipped. No, what happened? Okay, we're back again. How many pages left? This needs to end now, doesn't it? So they're on the ship now. There's uh, Peckham and uh, Gabby supporting Falco. Commander turned back Falco. Commander turned back Falco. Yeah, that could have been bad. Yeah, that could have... So, uh, where is Commander McGough? And, uh, what a stubborn man he is. And because like, oh, McGough stayed behind. What the hell's going on? And there's the Jaegers arriving now, I think. Enemy! They're still here, and McGough turns to fire, and oh, to, to, to those guys that were to fire at uh, McGough, they just got killed in the head by Shadis. Shadis just turned up. Oh my God, is that who they saw in the window when they were leaving at that time, like like two two chapters ago? And yeah, obviously Shadis was the one who derailed the the the, the train. He just landing in front of McGough. Was it you who stopped the Acheris reinforcements and such? So, so, yes. Why didn't you get on the ship? That that is a stolen ship from Marlene. With that kind of speed, it will catch up to our allies and sink them in no time. So McGough is pointing to one of the ships that they got. So he knows he stayed behind to blow it up. That can't stay here. Then I will help. Oh man. 
Oh, final moment with McGough and Shadis, man. Damn, two commanders of opposite sides, like, like teaming up. Oh. And there's the Aegis running for the Mylian ship. I saw the Mylian commander going into the ship. Attack. Use this ship to chase the enemy and sink them. Oh, they're inside. I don't know what. I don't know what they're. In. I think they're in the, the torpedo room or whatever. The ammunition room. Like, is that a bomb he's got out? What's going on? The the Shadi's holding. He's he's covering the door that they're here. McGoff's like doesn't matter. I'm gonna light the gunpowder on fire. If you want to dive into the sea, now is the time. No, I'm good. I was just wondering when I was going to die anyway. And McGoff turns at him. Why are you on our side? This island might get the worst of it. And Shadi's. I saw my students heading south from the fort in Chingangshina with Annie Lionheart. There I realized their goal. So yeah, that was Shadi's watching from the window. And I felt emotional. From from I think that's supposed to say from my students' growth. Okay. McGough, if you didn't stop the reinforcements, we would have been done for. You will become one of the heroes who saved the world, then the same goes for you. Oh man, I don't want him to die. No, oh, he's pouring the gun. Oh, he's got the cylinder out from one of those big ass bullets and he's pouring the gunpowder on the floor. I can't be proud of myself. I went against my will and followed the orders of my country and told those kids to destroy the walls. Oh, he's thinking, oh, he's thinking of, he's thinking of the warriors, man. He's thinking of Falco, Gabby, Peckham, Galliard, Reyna. And there's Zeke in the background, uh, Zofia, Udo, Marcel, and now I realise how happy I would be if those kids could live normal lives. Oh man. Battery's about to run out, I need to finish this quick. Is, is he handing him the rifle? Even if you aren't proud of yourself. Open up, uh, the they've arrived at the door, open up. I, uh, I think Shadiz is handing him the rifle, is he yeah he's handing him the rifle, he's handing him his rifle. Even if you aren't proud of yourself, I think you're a great person, and those kids probably do as well. Thanks. What is your name? Keith Shadis. You? Theo McGough. He's taking the rifle. He's putting it down by the gunpowder. We're getting a shot of uh, uh, we're getting a shot of Gabby by the rail with Peckhams, and she's crying. In the background, you've got Hanji and Jean and Kiyomi, like, and uh, next to Ga next to Gabby's side, it's uh, Okobayu and Yanina. They're crying, man, and yeah, they, oh, the, the bot, they, they blew, it blew up, the ship blew up, the Marlian ship, they can see the explosion from the distance, it looks like a nuke just went off, man. Humans can decide their own fate. Oh, man, I'm getting emotional now. I'm actually getting emotional, let's, oh, we just lost, me. we just lost McGough and Shardis, man. Oh, he was like he was like one of the oh, Shadis was like one of the last surviving commanders. Like Pixis and everyone else got freaking killed, and he was the last one standing. I didn't want him to die. Like, and McGough, he was like the only like he was the Malian commander for Christ's sake. He like he had like final word right with him gone. Like who's gonna do peace talks now? Ah, oh. that breaks my heart, man. Salute, man, for these two. We just lost two. We just lost one. We just lost a character that was with us since day one. Who find? Who finally, basically, did what he always wanted to do: die a hero, and and he did it. And McGough like sacrificed himself to keep his his either you know his allies alive. Like more 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 characters are gonna die, aren't they, man? Like. If, if there's only if there's only five more chapters left, the 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 rumors rumors you know predictions are there's probably going to be eight more left uh, nine more left now. We might get two more volumes instead of one more volume after after next month. But yeah, I'm thinking, oh man, like what what ending is Isayama going for? Is he still going for the mist ending? Is he still going for the Guardians of the Galaxy ending? Like I don't know, like. He could. Uh, this was a big surprise. I I honestly wasn't thinking these these two would get were, were gonna die. Like, I honestly didn't think. Like, damn. And Annie and Reyna came close to dying this chapter as well. If it wasn't for Falco saving the hides, man. Like, god damn. But yeah, like. 
So that's 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 the chapter, man. Like, uh, I hope you guys like my reaction. Like, what's gonna happen next next month? I'm assuming they're gonna have to get to the base, and we're gonna get more character moments as they're fixing up the plane before they head off. Maybe 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 the predictions are true, and we are gonna have like eight more chapters left off that next month because like there's a lot to wrap up and finish up with them confronting Aaron and having to find a way to stop him and that and getting Aaron's final thoughts and seeing what his whole plan and shenik is and finding out what happened to Zeke and I'm pretty sure Fal uh, uh, Flock's not dead so he's gonna show up somehow that bastard uh, anyway guys hope you like my reaction to this as always like and subscribe whatever and I shall see you when I shall see you take care and bye